Hello everyone, welcome back to Career Sing. So today we are going to give you HR questions which has been asked from 15th October till now. Today many students have HR round for the virtue sir. So we will be discussing all the questions with their answers. So let's start with the questions first. So the first question will be always tell me about yourself and your family background. They can ask about your family background but not confirm. So let's go through it. Now second question will be walk us through your resume. So means whatever the skills you have mentioned, projects and the experience you have, you have to tell them about your resume. Describe your educational qualification and academic performance. So in this, you don't have to just tell, uh, tell about your qualifications, but what are the performance, what are the things that you have done during your academic time, you have to tell them everything. Now coming to the next question, what were your roles and responsibilities in your previous job or project? So if you are experienced, then they will be asking about your job. And if you are fresher, then they will be asking about your project. So you have to tell them according to it. Why did you choose your specific engineering domain, switching from electronics to software? That question has been asked to me a uh, very time because I am from EC branch. So they can ask you why you are switching to the IT domain. What are your hobbies and extracurricular activities? So try to mention all the positive signs related to technology also. So it will be a plus point for you. What is your biggest regret and achievement so far? So you have to think about it and then tell about this question. Okay. Now, what do you want? Why do you want to join Virtusoft? And what do you know about the company? This is very important question. And mostly 70 to 80% students have faced this question during the interview. So you have to prepare well for this question. And in the after questions are finished, we will be telling you the answer that you can frame in your interview. Describe your ideal work environment. So you have to tell them what type of environment you want. So think and search from the Google or from the YouTube, then you can see that what type of environment everybody is preferred and what should it be. Okay. Why should we hire you? So tell all the pros that you have and try to minimize your negatives so it will be a plus point for you during the interview and what are the skills what are the achievements everything mentioned that will be a great foot for them that you are an ideal candidate for them okay now what are your expectation from the company so you have to frame this question frame the answer for it and as you see fit you can answer them discuss other companies you have applied and your current career option okay why would you leave if you received a better job offer so obviously you have to say no okay and tell them the better answer that you can tell them what interests you about this specific role so whatever the role you are applying like associate software engineer qa and there are many roles that they are currently hiring and interviews are currently ongoing so deep search about your role why do you want to work in it and everything? Okay. Where do you see yourself in five to 10 years? What are your short term goals, long term career goals? You have to tell them short term and long term goals are very important. So you have to tell them so they can understand how, how you feel and how you think. Do you plan to stay in a job for a long time or not? So obviously you have to say yes. If you say no and it will be a negative point for you. So you don't have to tell them. Are you willing to change your technical domain if needed? How do you handle work pressure and deadlines? How do you manage team conflict? Describe a time your work was criticized or a challenging situation you faced in a project or how you resolve it. How would you deal with your angry customer? It is for the VP role or uh, for the sometimes for technical role as well because you were in a meet with the customer client that you are assigned. Okay. Tell me about your unexpected situation you have encountered. These questions are very important. So don't miss this. This video is very important. You have to tell them everything. Why? How do you stay motivated with repetitive tasks? So this is a very important question. Also, one more thing. These are the questions that has been asked recently within a month. Okay. So you have to focus on these questions anyhow. Because if you can answer all of them without any problem then you can 
easily get into the virtual saw okay what are your typical work hours per week what are your main strength and weakness how do you fit with the company culture so you have to tell them what are the things common between you and the company which aligns with the company goal that's how you can give the answer to that question who is your biggest inspiration and why which movie character do you identify with and why are you open to relocating can you work night shift based on us timing so obviously you may have to work in the night shift because our indian clients basically are, we have from the us only what are your salary expectations so tell them it is for experience uh, students so you don't need to focus on that one okay now how you overcome your significant challenges how you are experience with the previous interview round everything you have to tell them about okay are you aware of company service agreement and everything these are the questions list and coming to the answers there are i have put some answers to them that you can see like general let's start with the okay tell me about yourself so i have just given a sample but it should be a long not that short like i am agun with a passionate and self motivated technology enthusiast from india i came from a supportive family that values education and discipline my parents have always encouraged me to sorry this is not a proper introduction so sometime i will put my official introduction that i say to every interview that i have done okay work us through your resume so you have completed a bachelor's degree you have to mention your projects whatever you have done what are your learning points from that that's the thing describe your educational qualifications what are your roles responsibility why do you choose your specific engineering domain there are the answers and i have put this in a sheet so you can download it from the top mate also along with it i have uh, uh, created a package where it includes coding questions technical questions and hr question this list will be also there and this is very important than the other because except for technical because these are the question that they will be asking apart from the technical also you can get rejected through hr round also there are, there are many students who get rejected after the hr round even if you are good at technical but you can't express uh, the if you can't clear the hr round then it will be a uh, tough okay so mainly focus on your communication skills if your communication skills are too good then there will be even if you make some mistakes then definitely you can get selected but try to give a positive answers which aligns through the company goals not with yours okay because you want to get into that company not they okay so that's it about today and if you like this video please like share and subscribe also if you have given your interview please let me know in the comment and it will be good if you can share the questions to our viewers they will be very helpful after listening to the question that how your interview went if you are telling your experience then they can at least be prepared before going to the final interview okay so thank you everyone for watching this video please like share and subscribe to our channel thank you